Singapore. Alright, so in the last episode, we have completed the village area and I am almost dead. But right now, we are going to continue at the farm, which basically is not really an intense part, but still interesting. So let's just go on. First of all, in this farm, we are going to collect some medallions. By shooting them, you can get each one of them. Here. And one of the guys here, by action. Oh. I'm gonna kill you with the knife. Oh. Come on. He is so tough. Oh, oh, oh. Hey. What? That is pretty like. Holy crap. Stupid, stupid, stupid. And I think these guys are getting tougher. Whatever it is, let's collect the medallions first. There are 15 of them. And if you collect for about 10 of them, you can get a free gun. And basically a very useful gun. Has a very special ability. There are one over here. By the way, I remember... Oh! <gasps> I think my aim is pretty bad right now. And I don't know why. And... A lot of things should be done at this farm. First of all... Over here, shoot this one. Oh, come on! My aim is a pretty crap today. Take it. Let's just go. There are seven in this farm and there are eight at the cemetery. About the blue medallions. Okay, I know this one. And one right at the top of this building. Which is up there. Uh, can I get this in one shot? Yes. Wonderful. Basically, the farm is the only place that you can actually gather up all the bullets that you have wasted while you are fighting in the village. And I'm collecting back again because I've been losing so much bullets during the village battle. Collecting here. Oh! Oh crap. Come on. Why the hell do you go over there? I'm dead. Oh, come on. Give me some bullets. I need them. Okay. Come on. Right above here. And there is this, this guy working his ass off. But now he's gonna die too. Come on. Oh. Knife is probably one of the strongest weapons in this game, so better be use of them. Come on. Ew, ew. You freak. Oh god. This is super terrible. I think I should have used one of my medicines. Use this. And jump right over here. And that is a pretty dumb mistake. I should be more careful, right? Mm -hmm. Yep, another one. Another one is right over here. You don't really need to shoot all of them and if you can shoot maybe 10 of them, you can get a free gun. But if you are able to shoot all of them, you will get the same gun with an upgraded version. So, that can save one of your, some part of your money. Mm. That's fine now. Nothing. Ah, uh, right over here there is another one which is probably the hardest to get. Because they're so far away. Can I get that one in one shot? Woo! Wonderful! Oh yeah! Very good! And... Left with one thing. Right down here, there's a treasure. You got a beer style. This is a very good one. And that treasure can be combined with some other treasure which makes it, makes it more expensive. And you can get more money from selling it. Um, and I hate this part. Let's read. I've seen this signpost before. And this signpost means there will be some kind of danger ahead. And this is probably the part that I hate. First of all, I'm gonna kill them. Come on. So that I don't need to kill them later on in the game. Come on. Dead. Yay! Okay, this is so crazy golden. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. That's why I hate that part, because if you make a mistake, you'll die straight away. And that, that moment really makes me tired for a short moment. Because you need to be really energetic to keep on going. Right over you, okay, but that part is over, so I'm glad. Okay. 
shoot this one. Not a spino. And right over here, you need to be really careful because of these guys are holding dynamites. So I think it is better to have some distance. Because if they explode, they might get in trouble. Yep, just like that. Oh crap. Oh. And there are a lot of traps in this place too. And there is this one really annoying guy who is throwing dynamites. Come on. Yes! Woo! I'm getting a little bit lucky over there. Suddenly my aim gets really better than the last time. And in this house there are a bunch of them. So I need to be really fast. Come on, turn it up. Boom! Oh yes! Come on. Man, there is this stupid guy. Come on! Blow yourself up! Oh god! Oh, 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 oh. Hey! Oh no. Oh god. Get away from me! Come on! Oh gosh! And... They are pretty tough too. Come on please! Oh hey, hey you're dead. Come on! Turn it up! Okay, die. Oh my god! Hey, don't play with dynamites! Hmm. Hey! I don't really know why they died, but, but I don't. And this is the one that I was talking about, okay? Right over here. You can use this one to combine with this one, okay? I mean like the one that we get earlier on in the game, which is at the farm. There are a lot of good items in this house too. Give me more coins. And I believe there's a grenade over here. Yep. Hand grenade. Probably I think the, the most useful grenade in the game, man. Because it is just so good. Let's go inside of this cabin. And right now our mission is to find the guy that was mentioned in the later somewhere. And that guy is inside of this because he is probably one of the most important guy. Because he helps us a lot. Especially to find Ashley. Well, this one and I think oh, that, this is wonderful yay let's reload the gun and we are at the end of the chapter this is the guy that I was talking about he was locked up in here by some of the culture and here he is <laughs> ah, a little rough don't you think you are unlike them you're not like them? No. You? Do you have a smoke? Okay. I have only one very important question. Do you got a smoke? Got gum. The big chief! Guys! The chief of the village! The big cheese. My di that little bitch. Okay, my hit ratio is 92%. Wonderful. No time skill. Zero. Okay, let's save the game. We are at the end of the chapter and let's begin this second chapter right away. Feeble humans, let us give you our power. And they actually inject us with something scary. <laughs> I'm unable to resist this intoxicating power. Whoa! So, this power must be really, really powerful. And also deadly, probably. Hey, hey, wake up. Ay, ay, ay. Hey, wake up. Crawl from one hole into another. Ay, ay, ay. Crawl out of one hole and into another. You want to tell me what's going on here? Americano, see? Si? Now what brings a bloke like you to this part of the world? Oh, hey, easy, whoever you are. 
Name's Leon. Came here looking for this girl. I see Graham. Seen her? What, are you supposed to be a cop or something? Nah, you don't look the type. Maybe. Okay, let me guess. She's the president's daughter? <laughs> <laughs> That's too good for a guess. Wanna start explaining? Psychic powers. Ah. Nah, <laughs> just kidding with you, amigo. I overheard one of the villagers talking something about the president's daughter in the church. Okay. <laughs> Oh crap! You look scary! And who might you be? Me llamo Luis Serra. I used to be a cop in Madrid. Luis Serra, guys. But now I'm just a good for nothing guy who happens to be quite a ladies' man. Ladies' Why'd man? Why'd you quit? Mm. Phew, policia. You put your life on the line, nobody really appreciates you enough for it. Being a hero isn't what it's cracked up to be anymore. Mm -hmm. Used to be a cop myself. Only for a day, though. I thought I was bad. Somehow I managed to get myself involved with the incident in Raccoon City on my first day in the force. Yep, Raccoon that City. That is the incident with the viral outbreak, right? I think I might have seen a sample of the virus in a lab at the department. Hey boy, I'm not dying. Oh god. Do something, cop. What the heck? You. Whoa, whoa. Now. I totally forgot about that one. But it is pretty slow. Ooh. I'm gonna give you this, Leon. Wonderful cake. Wonderful app for everything. Ba -ba -ba. Let's talk to this girl. It's Leon. Sorry I couldn't get in touch sooner, but I was a bit, tied, a bit up. tied up. You're okay, right? Yes. I'm fine. There was a male civilian held captive. According to him, Ashley's in a church somewhere. What happened to him? He managed to escape. Do you have a fix on the location of that church? No. But apparently there's a secret passage in the village that leads there. I'm heading back to the village. Okay. Wonderful. I'm heading back to the village. Stop. Mm -hmm. And right now, actually, I lost my jacket. Probably stolen by one of the guys in the village. And until the end of the game, we'll never get it back. So that's it. Mm -hmm. oh, this yeah. is the merchant. Right, yeah. And this guy is really important. Probably the important, the most important guy in the game because he helps us a lot of freaking times. Let's see what he got. Got something that might interest you. <laughs> got a selection of good, good things, things on, on sale, sale stranger. stranger. Don't know if you guys, stranger, but did you see the blue medallions hanging around the place? Yeah, I saw them. Come back after you have shot them, just like I said. Have more of them. I've got a special gun I wanted to try out. Yeah. What are you selling? First of all, I'm gonna sell all of my treasures. Seven. Is that all? <laughs> yep. Thanks. Me. Ah. Well, ah. But <laughs> Thank you. I'm not gonna sell the beer sign because we haven't really completed I mean, the combination. They are red, green, and yellow. So right now, there's only red in there. And I'm gonna find the other two. Mm, that's okay. What are you buying? I'm gonna buy Is a bigger bag. <laughs> Thank you. And a rifle. Is that... Yeah, I like this gun. <laughs> and Thank of course, you. with rifle, I'm gonna buy a scope. Is that all? And I'm gonna put it over here. <laughs> Thank you. Not enough cash. Not enough cash. Stranger. Stranger. All right, I know. You don't really need to be so what mad. What are you buying? Let's upgrade the firepower, of course. Is that all? <laughs> and Thank the you. reload speed is pretty important too. Is that all, strength? <laughs> and Thank I am almost running out of cash, but that doesn't that doesn't matter because now I got a stronger gun. And especially I have the rifles. With bigger bags, I can fill up my bags with more items in it. Let's just go on. Okay, right now let's just go here, okay? Uh, this part is getting more interesting. There are a bunch of guys here. Uh, and I think I'm gonna need my shotgun. Come on. Woo! And this is the place that I think probably is really annoying too because these guys over here holding dynamite too. Come on. Ah, come on, here they are. Just die, okay? Boop! Come on, kill your buddy! Boop! First of all, I'm gonna make him kill all of his buddy. Only then I will go down. Oh, come on! Woo! I got it! And... Will they come again? Yep! Here they are! Shit! The only guy that I am actually afraid of is 
that with the dynamite. Why kick?
believe I got everything this time. Nope. Mm, more gold. And wait a moment. Right over in this house, which I went here before, but I missed this one. Let's just take it and leave this freaking town. It looks like something fits inside this hexagonal adaptation. Yes, yes. Combine and open. Go. And as usual, this part, the game goes like this. When there is an intense part, there will be some part that is a little bit boring, should I say? Because this is the moment where actually you can collect some of your ammo in order to have a big battle again. And open the door. And take all the stuff inside of here. Oh, right over on the side, there's a treasure. But we will only get that later on. Yeah. Whoa. I hate that guy. Holy fuck, my genius. Come on! Yes! Woo! Okay, I've been using too much of my shotgun. I have to use knife? Hmm, let's see, let's do this. Here's the mother, and yep, you're dead. But I don't really like this type of healing medicine because it costs so much space. Better use it. I think I'm gonna take one of them, but not the big one. And can I have another small one here? There are four small and one big. Oh, crap! They're dead. Wow. I think I'm gonna take one and leave this place. Yes. Wonderful. 
<laughs> Reload and leave. Okay, shoot. Dead. And shoot the grenade. And the two guys died. Take this one. And be careful. As usual. And don't ever, ever forget this. Take shoot this and shoot this. Fuck! Ah! Alright, guys. Woo, whatever. How's your day going? If you guys watch this on the day I have uploaded this one, this must be on Wednesday. Wednesday is a great day, right? <laughs> what a wonderful man. moment. And we are at the end of the chapter. This chapter is pretty short. And a small puzzle go up and go right. Easy. Solve, solve, solve. And before that, let's just check. And take this one. Mm, and there is a note, a right note. Let's read. As instructed by Lord Sadler, I have the agent in confinement alive. Why keep him alive? I do not fully understand what the Lord's intentions are. I would, however, think he'd kept them separate, not confine them together as he has been ordered. Hmm. I don't expect Lewis would trust a stranger, but if by chance they did cooperate, the situation could get more complicated. If for some reason an unknown third party is involved, I don't think they'd let the chance like this slip. Oh. But maybe it's all Lord Sadler's ploy, leaving us vulnerable so that the third party will surface if they even exist, that is. It's an unlikely possibility, but if a prowler is already amongst us, then our plans could be ruined. I guess the Lord thinks it's worth the risk if we are able to stop whatever conspiracy is at work. At any rate, it's the Lord's call. We will trust his judgment as always. So that is what they are planning. Probably don't really know why. They inject us with something. Probably that thing actually can control our action. Who knows, right? Okay, end of the chapter. There are a bunch of guys talking. You, you backstabber. Asshole. Ooh. You carry the same blood as us, it seems. Nevertheless, you're an outsider. Just remember, if you become unpleasant to our eyes, you'll face severe consequences. You know what? You're gonna face the severe consequences too. What? If we ever fight so again. Blood. <laughs> hey, end of chapter, and my accuracy is getting worse. Enemy skill 47, total 85, together with chapter 1 verse 1. And so far, no time skill. We are doing pretty good. And I think, guys, this is a really good part to end the episode. Hope you guys have a good Wednesday. And if you enjoyed this video, go and like it. And of course, don't forget, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to my channel and enjoy some of my videos. And I will see you guys again in the next episode. Bye.